hata wale magaidi wanaojificha kwa siasa kujaribu kuhujumu usalama wa nchi tutawakalia ngumu Tijui kama tunaelewana kwa sababu hakuna tofauti wanatatiza watu kule Nairobi ati sijui ni maandamano maandamano ni kupiga polisi na mawe kuvunja duka kuchoma barabara na kutatiza uchukuzi wa umma I want to make it very clear that all people who are hiding behind politics to commit crime have a date with us and have a date with law enforcement officers. We are not suffocating any freedoms in this country. The constitution allows people to do politics, to disagree in terms of policies. There is nothing wrong with the opposition disagreeing with government on policies. There is no problem the opposition having rallies and meetings which are purely political. But we have a problem with violent riots where property is being destroyed, people are being hurt, the economy is being shut down, public transport is paralyzed. We will not allow people to hide under the guise of political rights and the freedoms of our constitution to cause mayhem and bloodshed in our country. Two Wednesdays ago, we tried to test whether there could be a peaceful demonstration. And for about two or three hours, we thought those who were demonstrating would be peaceful. But by the time we realized a lot of damage, a lot of bloodshed, a, a, a lot of destruction had been committed. By the time we asked the security forces to move in and disrupt those criminals, it was in the afternoon. And you would see the damage that had already been uh, caused. And that is why last week we decided we are not going to allow the same same criminals to do what they did two Wednesdays ago. And that's why we will remain firm. I hear they have again threatened that they will want to go out on a looting spree on Wednesday. We are ready for them. We will deploy from 1 a.m. We will make sure that no hooligan, no criminal, no looter gets his way. Let people do their politics peacefully and in a civilian manner. Let people do whatever they want peacefully. But looting, theft, robbery, crime will not be permitted. Na hapo atulegezi kamba. Kwanza ile ya last week, hizi kutatu hili likuwa kidogo. This time round will be even more vicious. Kwa sijaribu, hiyo kama tunaelewana. Mungetaka tuchome inchi yetu. So we will be very firm. Na sisi atufanyi siyasa. As we are not doing politics. Wale wako siyasa, akina kamuren, na ile grupu ingine, governors, senators, wale wakafanya siyasa huko. As we are security managers, our work is to make sure our country is safe. Na mtu wa sijificha kwa siyasa akithani ya tituwa muogopa. Tutakabiliana na wewe hata ukiwa nani kwa sababu wale wanadhuru usalama. Haijalishi wewe ni wakabila gani, wewe ni dini gani, wewe uko na cheo gani. Cheo ya sasa, cheo ya zamani, tutakukabili na hakuna kitu utafanya. Tukanyangia hapo? Tukanyangia hapo? Ama tuachiria wakora wa haribu inchi? Apana, apana, apana. We can't allow. Hakuna tofauti ya ile violence tuliona two weeks ago na ile violence inaletwa na our bandits. There is no difference. It's the same. 
Mukitaka ufanya siasa mufanya siasa civilian activity mupingane huko na mambo ya sera Kenya kwanza wakisema wanataka ku subsidize fertilizer nyinyi museme you don't want to subsidize fertilizer you want to do something else Lakini mambo ya mawe na mauaji hapana So I dare those who want to break the law on Wednesday I dare them to try We are more than ready Kwa hivyo mimi nataka niachie hapo na washukuru sana na wapenda sana nitarudi tena na tena na tena na tena Asanteni sana Mungu wa